Hum. Mm, noob jam. Hello and welcome back to Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Alright, let's go do a side quest. I think that's just fight himself. Hello. You wanna fight Gohan, don't you? Dude! Hey, it's been a while. Mm. What am I doing here? Was my core not completely destroyed? Perfecting perfection! Cell has been brought back to life with the Dragon Ball. See if he'll become your training partner. Okay. I brought you back with the Dragon Balls. By the way, where is this core you're talking about? <laughs> I'm not in the habit of divulging my secret to my enemies. I heard you told Vegeta and everyone else. <laughs> you think what I told them was the truth? Oh, I get it. Anyway, <laughs> let's go a few rounds. I could use the training. Noni. And why would I do something like that? <laughs> because you want to. Oh. Is that so? You've got science cells in you, right? Then you can't resist the urge to fight. <laughs> Just like me. <laughs> You're not exactly wrong. Huh? I suppose I could make you rethink your decision to revive me. Yay! Well, I almost killed him with that, so let's finish him off. Goodbye! Yay, success! I suppose I shouldn't be surprised, you are Goku after all. You're far stronger than you were during the Cell games. <laughs> but if you're capable of such strengths, then I, being comp comprised of yourself, should be as well. Yeah, probably. <laughs> you will be bowing before me after our next fight. Cool, I can't wait. Alright, I guess we can have to fight Cell again, perhaps, maybe. Oh, nice! Oh, he's very good at a lot of things. Good. Okay, he vanished and then came back. That's perfectly fine. It's okay. Awesome. Yeah, Cell is pretty incredible. West City? Maybe. Let's go. I think I'm almost done with all of the side quests here. I think, anyway. I'm not certain, but I believe. So it is very, very soon the time I will head into the final DLC of this game. Here it come. Alright, here it come. What's coming? Oh, sweet sarsaparilla. What is... Aral and those thing that can shoot laser if I remember right. Yo. Hey, it's you. Hiya. Huh? Who are you, mister? Do you know me? Yeah, yeah, I know you. I met you when I was little. <laughs> you really helped me out when the Red Ribbon Army was trying to steal my Dragon Balls. Hiya. Oh yeah? Really? Hiya. Man, it's been forever. I was in a real hurry back then, so I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Goku, nice to meet you. I'm Aral, and this is Gachan. Well, he said it. So what are you guys doing all the way out here? Mm, hmm, we walked too far. Can you make your way back home without getting lost? Mm, which way is Penguin Village? 
<laughs> Wait, you mean you guys are already lost? Oh, yeah. Hmm? I'm lost? Do you know where Penguin Village is? <laughs> Here it comes! Aral and her friends are lost and far away from home. Help them find Penguin Village. I guess. Here it comes! Sure, I guess I could take you guys there. Hooray! So what are you gonna do? So excited, so excited! Ah, wait, I don't remember where your village is. Oh no, oh no! Don't worry, I know what to do. I'll ask Fortune Teller Baba. Fortune Smeller Baba? Is she strong? Yeah, in a way, she's crazy. Sm she's a crazy smart old lady that'll definitely be able to tell us where your village is. <laughs> Hooray! Let's go see Fort and Smeller Baba. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hold on just a sec. I'm gonna see if I can find out where she is. Yes. Found her. I'm gonna use instant transmission, so grab on. Hi. Okie dokie. Are you fortune? Are you fortune smeller, Baba? You have a funny face. <laughs> What's the meaning of this, Goku? Who are these rude little pests? <sighs> oh, uh, this little girl's Aral. She she's lost and need to find her way back home. Would you be able to tell us where that is? <laughs> yeah, it's called Penguin Village. <sighs> What do you think I am, a daycare service? Ah, oh, come on, fortune teller Baba. I have a heart. Um, if you want my help, it'll cost you. Oh, uh, I don't have any money, but I'll go get you some gemstone. That'll work, right? <laughs> we'll see. Go get the gemstone, then. <laughs> Alright, I'll go find some now. Alright. Pretty sure I already have all of that, but... Did I have all... Alright! <laughs> Apparently I already had those. Alright, this should be enough for Fortune Teller Baba to help us. I did it! <laughs> Got what you wanted, Fortune Teller Baba. Well now, these are mighty fine gemstones. <laughs> so does that mean you're gonna help us find Penguin Village? <laughs> Very well, I'll help you. <laughs> so excited, so excited. <laughs> penguin, Penguin, Penguin Village. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> well, did you find it? The crystal bulge ball showed the path to Penguin Village. <laughs> Great, got it. We should be good to go now. <sighs> hm. If that's all you need, go on then. Thank you. Sure thing. Thanks, Fortune Teller Baba. Yes. Right, or all. You're ready to go back to Penguin Village? <laughs> well, <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. We didn't really bring her back there though, but alright. I mean, we didn't do it yet. Oh, then. I didn't think getting that little girl back to Penguin Village would take so long. Doma. Excuse me. I know. Dr. Slump, Sempe. Um, you wouldn't happen to see some energetic little children around here, would you? <laughs> energetic children? Wait, are you talking about Aral and her friends? <laughs> D yes, are they here? <laughs> no, they're back in Penguin Village now. <laughs> what? <laughs> Whoa, what's with the screaming? Everything okay? <sighs> I I'm sorry, I'm just a little flustered. I left the village to find Aral, but my plane started to malfunction. 
And on top of that, I was so wrapped up in finding her that I lost track of where I am. Uh, now I'm the one that's lost. Wait, if you're looking for Aral, doesn't that mean you're from Penguin Village? You, you know about Penguin Village? Yeah, I just came back from there. Huh? You just came back from there? Well, since I know how to get to Penguin Village now, you want me to take you there? Yes, please. Thank you so very much. Jeez, you must have really been in trouble to have a reaction like that. But how are we going to get there? You don't seem to have a plane or other vehicle. I'll just use instant transmission, or at least I would if I could sense Arl's keys. Oh well, I just have to fly you there then. Ah no! Uh, fly? You can fly? Ah. Yep. But if you fall, you'll probably die, so make sure you hold on tight. Mm -hmm. Wait, wait, d die? <laughs> Alright, here we go! <laughs> yeah. Uh, aren't you going a little fast? I'm, I'm going to fall! Yes. Let's kick it up a notch! Yeah. Ah! Senbei Norimaki finally makes it makes it back to Penguin Village, but the whole ordeal seemed to have taken a lot out of him. Alright then. Good. Alright, well, success. We had the little uh, Aral cameo. Which is kind of nice. All this is inexcusable, apparently. <gasps> is it, though? Is it? Well, you said it. Huh? Who are you? You mean who is he? You know who it is. Wait, I know this key. Is that you, Frieza? Hmm. Hmm. That's right, you never had the privilege to see me in this form. Didn't we? I guess we didn't. I'm sorry, but what is it that you wanted from me? The return of the Emperor. Oh, he looks so unhappy. Frieza just as full of himself as he was before. Try sparing against him. Okay. Why do you say we have a little sparring match? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Do you mean to tell me that is what you have revived me? Ah. Yeah, I guess you could say that. <laughs> I have countless planets and thousands of servants at my disposal, I'll have you know. Knowing that you still intend to use me, the great Emperor Frieza, as your sparing partner? Yeah, yeah. You're a big deal. Got it. Come on, let's do this. I see you haven't changed. You still have a knack for getting on my nerves. I haven't changed either. As I drifted through space half dead and even after having been consigned to hell, I have never forgotten the humiliation you caused me. <laughs> Your key is so massive. You're shaking the whole planet. I can't wait to fight you. Didn't say let us begin, but that was close enough. I'm assuming he's gonna transform. But... Alright then. I know there is no other finisher than the, the two I'm using. I had hope. I had some hope. But I should not have had hope. 
Well, I suspect this form alone wouldn't be enough to best you. Consider this a mere warm-up. Come on, Frieza. Don't be so stingy. I'm not gonna get better if you don't go all out on me. You irritating little pest. <laughs> so you're finally getting serious. <laughs> this time you will be gro groveling at my feet. I don't know about that. I mean, I can do that too. Oh, that's not fair. Screw that. Ta -da. So is he gonna go a, a level above now? When he's all muscled up? Hmm, I suppose my having just being revived is to blame for this performance. <laughs> if you're feeling a little rusty, then there's always next time. Next time? Yeah, I want to train with you again. Mm. I must say, I've never cared for how you speak to me. <laughs> but very well. <laughs> After all, a being of my genius would surely exceed you if I were to commit to this training nonsense. <laughs> Bear in mind, however, that I still intend to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> That's the spirit. Alright then. We did it! Now, there's only Dabra left, right? You may come to regret reviving me in the end. Probably. Alright. Oh. I'm going through those side quests faster than I thought I would. There was a whole four of them, I thought it would take a hot second to do them. Nope. Did it just say rather lovely? That's right, for him, instead of sending him in hell, they send him in heaven, because hell was basically the same as his home. Alright, well, let's see what happened. Whoa, is that you, Dabra? <laughs> Mm. Oh, Goku, my most profound apologies for the trouble I caused you and your friends. <laughs> I want to go a few round with you, so what do you say? Come on! Masaka. You, you want to fight me? Absolutely not. I cannot bear to harm another living thing. Th did something happen to you? I could have sworn you were a bad guy last time we met. <sighs> Indeed I was, and I was wrong then. I was merely fulfilling my role as a king of the demon realm. When King Yenma, Yenma saw how elated I was at the prospect of going to hell, he sent me to heaven. What? You went to heaven? Hi. Yes. The time I spent there allowed me to see the error of my ways and cleanse my heart of evil. And that is why I cannot fight you. Man, that sucks. I was really hoping to fight you. I'm sorry to disappoint you, but I can't fight if I have no reason to do so. King of the Demon Realm, Dabro is back and he's a changed man. A demon. See if he'll forego his pacifist way and fight you. Well, let's see what happened. I know. What if I paid you to fight me? I I'm sorry, but I'm afraid that's not a good enough reason. <laughs> I know this guy named Mr. Satan. He got loads of money. I could get him to pay you. You could use that money to do some real good in the world. <laughs> so if I fight you, I could receive enough money to help others. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> I see. Very well then, I'll accept your offer. Lucky. Now you're talking, alright! I, 
feel like we could have convinced him a different way, but oh well. I got an A. Why is that? Basically killed him in two shots. Was that not good enough? Were you not entertained? What's wrong? Is that all pow all the power you can muster? You still have yet to see what I'm capable of. Jeez, you really are something else. Are you not aware of who I am? Huh? You're a really good guy now, right? No. <gasps> <sighs> oh my, it appear I've gotten a little carried away. Thank you. you know, I'm actually relieved. You're still just as strong as before. Let me know if you want to fight again. Uh, I will. Oh yes, about the money you promised me. Mm -hmm. As there is no need for me to receive it myself, I would like to have it donated to a charitable organization. Ah. You got it, I'll ask Mr. Sutton to take care of that next time I see you. Oh. Mission accomplished? I did it? Success? Oh, he's not golden. Yeah, so now is a new side quest available for me, perhaps? Nope. That's all the side quests in the game, I guess. Well, what do you know? What do I do now? I guess I could fight some villainous enemy for a little while. Why not, right? I'm gonna get the whole team together and we're gonna blast their ass. As long as they're not level 200 or some ridiculous nonsense like this. 110, I can deal with that. Alright, party. You and you. There we go, perfection. Do you have any other other abilities that are perhaps more interesting? You got the limit break, Masengo. That's much better. And short this. I. I'm ready to rock, I guess. Let's go. Well then, next time I'm gonna I'm gonna do the the final two DLCs, I guess. I'm gonna start it. Anyway. I don't really need to do this, but might as well, right? Just a little bit for fun. Oh, well. I am a teeny tiny bit above their level, but not that much. Oh. Start to get rid of all of them, see what happens. Right? Hold on. It takes longer getting to them than actually killing them. That's, that's how powerful this nonsense is. I love it! <laughs> oh, wait. Uh, character... you... Ah! Sure, instead of Kaioken that I'm not using. Sure, why not, right? 
I have yet to use them anyway, so might as well. So... I put the wrong button, but you know what, that works. Alright, that's pretty cool. Can I level up that? Can I, can I like, upgrade it so I do even more? Mm. It does not appear that I can. Yeah, it's just a special one. Alright. I kind of wish they would tell me like what the stats of Vegito is supposed to be, but it's fine, I suppose. Should I do extra video to fight all villains enemy? Nah, probably not. That seems just time consuming. Right. What if? I was thinking I should I can probably like I was thinking I could go into super mode and then murder the universe but I can't do that they be too strong! Alright. Who's closest to me? I don't know who you are. And I know your level. And I'm sorry for what's about to happen to you. Right. I have infinite Vegito now, that's kind of cool. At least as far as I know, I have infinite Vegito. Oh, you know, I'm gonna finish where I started here. I'm gonna fight all the villainous enemy I can. This is for funsies. Because why not? It's not like they're challenging in any way, right? Run, do the thing! Stop him! I think I'm too far away from him. Okay, that's the stuff. Uh, is there a way for me to see Vegito and what he does, perhaps? Is he a different character I can... Nope. It is not. Alright, well. I was thinking perhaps I can, but no I cannot. Hmm. Yeah, sure, why not? I used the wrong thing. The wizard would have won a little something like this. Ta -da. Success. And now a super powerful Vegeta. So threatening. 
maybe. Where is he? All the way over there. Of course he is. Oh! He's gonna be my last victim. I honestly thought it was gonna take me 40 minutes or so to do the whole thing, but nope, I'm pretty much, uh, I'm doing it fine. Hello, it's me. Oh, wait. It is so cheap to use the big bang attack. It's ridiculous. I'm not convinced it does more. Eh, although, you're level 125, so it's not meant to one shot them, I suppose. Anyway, let's just be in that level. Yeah, all of you are together, so might as well. Don't stick close to each other, you ghouls. I said don't. Oh, no, it's only you. Uh, success. Level up. Yay! And I did all the villainous enemy in this area. If I do all the villainous enemy anywhere, do I fight? Do I get to fight Mira again? I guess, but he's gonna be a ludicrously high level. I'm not gonna do that anyway. Next time, I'm going to do the DLC. And after I'm done with the DLC, I'm out of here. I'm gonna start a whole new game. So, thank you very much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed this episode. And also, if you could help me out by pressing all the good buttons under this video, that will be greatly appreciated. And with all of that said, I bid you a glorious day, and I do hope to see you in the next episode of Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Bye bye